The question is whether silver sulfate, that's Ag2SO4, is soluble or insoluble in water. And the short answer is it's insoluble in water. There's a few ways that we can figure that out. First, we could look at the solubility rules. So as we go down here, we see that most sulfates, this is the sulfate, most sulfates are soluble. They'll dissolve in water, except these few things here, and there's the silver. So Ag2SO4 will be insoluble in water according to our rules. There's another way we can look at this, and we could get a solubility chart. So here's just a portion of a solubility chart, kind of the bottom of it. And we look and find the positive ion, that's silver right here, Ag plus, and then we're looking for the sulfate. So we go over here and way over here, SO4, two minus. So if we go across, and then we go up, we see that SS. SS means slightly soluble. So it's very close to insoluble. In fact, when we do net ionic equations, if it said slightly soluble, we'd consider that insoluble. So all compounds, even if it says insoluble, they'll dissolve a little bit. And when it says slightly soluble, that's a bit more. So we tend to consider insoluble and slightly soluble to be very similar. Not much dissolves. There's one more way we could do this. We could put some Ag2SO4 in water, and based on the rules, we would expect it to be insoluble. Based on our solubility chart, slightly soluble, but pretty close to insoluble. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.